What is going on? Welcome back. Exciting first day bass fishing. Um, this is my first trip out for the year and I finally pulled the trigger and bought a GoPro Hero 9 Black. I'm super excited. This was a test run with the camera to try to figure out settings, the voice commands, while of course fulfilling one of my nephew's annual birthday wishes to go fishing. Um, so let's see how this goes. First trip with the GoPro, headed to the local pond, um, aka my town lake. Going a little light action today, a um, little finesse fishing. Let's see how the GoPro works out. Um, nephew should be joining, brother Brian is not. Got a little guy out here in his canoe fishing. Let's see how he's doing. All right. Kind of weedy as you can see I'm doing a little bit of uh, finesse fishing. I'm gonna walk over to some of the overhangs over here. Got some good down trees and whatnot over here, so should create some sort of uh, cover for these elusive bass. Um, for so early on in the season, it is super, 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 super uh, weedy in there. It's crazy. Um, good news is, is I see motion already in here, which is cool. Um, I'm gonna start over here to the right and work my way over. first one all right second bass I think <laughs> yeah it's a bass look at this baby look at that oh yeah don't get caught up in that come here oh look at this beaut number two for the day finesse fishing stop it my worm's gone that's all right. Look at this beauty. Right in the top of the mouth. Typically in the corner. We need to take this out with the pliers. I always forget on these. I just put this on clamp down that barb because this is just stupid I'm not eating them I don't eat it as you can see this just takes way too long so here's what we do push it through that barb down while it's in his mouth. See it slid right out. Look at this beaut. Number two. And he's off. Like I said my worm is gone. We're gonna change that out. Cousin Joe for the win with the selection on setup here. Amazing day. So, still trying to figure out this voice. Just caught a small little bass, beautiful. Number four of the day, missed two. Um, there apparently are some perch in here, so I decided to switch gear a little bit and throw in a little, little treble. This is a, a lure that I use for trout fishing and something I'll be using up in Lake George. Um, I figured I'd just get acquainted with it. Lost my leader on the last one, so rather than tie it on because I'm lazy, we're not gonna do that. And I'm just gonna swim here for a few minutes with this. <laughs> All right. 
same thing. <laughs> no, I'm in a different spot. Hey, good man. You found one for you. See, match the hatch, baby. All right, so pretty successful day. Had a couple of small guys um, on my trout lure. That was awesome. Um, so I'm total six fish caught, missed two. Just had something dart out here. Um, opted for the whopper plopper. Seeing a little bit of top water, which is strange because it's breezy and I think a storm's rolling in. Um, so I'm using the whopper plopper. I've had three hits on it. I am absolutely terrible at throwing and hooking with the frogs. So I missed them. Um, but massive blow ups on the surface. Pretty much out there where I just cast it. it was really burning when I was moving them too. Let's see if we slow them down, what happens. So the kids lost pickerels too. And then uh, brother-in-law caught a beautiful pickerel, I'd say almost two feet long, which was wild. Um, there is a lot of food in here. This breeze is really picking up. Um, all in all, a great day. I'm gonna call it a day in a moment. Took my leader off, I was getting annoyed. I, I lost another rig. Um, and uh, that's it. So what is going on? So that was uh, an awesome little day out there on the local lake. Um, you may call it a pond because it is kind of small, but uh, you know, it's all in all six fish, lost two. Uh, had a couple big blow ups at the end there on the whopper plopper, nothing like top water bite. It's uh, gotta be honest, it's something to get your blood pumping. Um, looking forward to it. I feel like I got the finesse fishing down. Um, that'll be great for Lake George this upcoming week. Um, and looking forward to, you know, getting into some lake trout and salmon, hopefully. We'll see how that works out, though. Until next time.